Members of the Mona Shores football team are about to have a once in a lifetime experience, but one of the most talked about stories of the summer nearly threw a wrench in their plans. 13 on your size, Matt Guard shows us what happened and who saved the day. Last year we played a team like a matter to walk for a school in uh, Wisconsin, which is really like just west of Ludington. And, and they took the, bad, the SS Badger over last year, uh, took it into Ludington, drove down and played a game. Uh, they stayed a couple of days uh, with us, uh, and now it's our turn. Only one problem. The SS Badger's ramp was damaged earlier this summer, and it's done making trips across the lake for the season. We were scrambling with that, but uh, and the Lake Express stepped up and were just incredible. Uh, helping us out because it is a little bit more expensive than the Badger and they kind of met us halfway so it made us able to do that so kudos to the Lake Express. We're looking forward to hopefully giving a memorable trip uh, to all those uh, student athletes and obviously the coaches as well. Uh, this will be a little different than the normal bus trip. The sailors will leave port here in Muskegon on Thursday, August 24th. They will have team dinner with their opponents from Manitowoc that very same night and come Friday, it's game time. It's awesome to have another opportunity to just one last time spend a, a, a week in a hotel with my best friends in the whole world. How many high school players can say that they traveled across the state or even across the uh, whole lake? It certainly is a special opportunity these days but it used to be more common. I was talking to Ron Pesha, a historian of this area uh, with Big Red football and just Muskegon football, and he said, I said, I don't know if anyone's ever done that. And he said, I guess in the, in the 20s, they used to do it all the time where teams took it across and played. So it hasn't been a while, but I'm super excited to do it. It kind of puts things into perspective when you have kids from Michigan and, you know, eating dinner with each other from uh, kids from Wisconsin the game before. So I think that's pretty special in itself, too. Reporting in Muskegon, I'm Matt Gard for 13 on your side.